This is considered one of the safer parts of Afghanistan. It's perhaps more famous for its historic shrines and vibrant business community than anything else. But nevertheless, people are still on high alert. The Taliban have threatened to disrupt these elections, and there have already been a number of high-profile attacks in the capital, Kabul. In this province, six polling stations will be closed for security reasons. But we're told the vast majority of people across Afghanistan will be able to take part in this historic vote. Well, holding elections here in Afghanistan is a major logistical challenge and planes like these have been used to bring the materials in. The coalition forces have been asked by the Afghan authorities to help distribute 360 tons, that's 13,500 boxes of election materials, to four regional hubs. Well, behind these doors is a very important cargo. Of course, this is where all the election materials are being kept under very, very tight security. These blue boxes contain the ballot materials. These are the ballot papers inside. As you can see, all of them are sealed. A lot of store is being set by security this time round. And on each of the election boxes here, there's the province and the district where they're intended to go for. And that's why they're putting them up on the truck here. They'll then distribute them out to the more outlying areas, not necessarily just by truck, but by bicycle, by donkey, but by any other means possible.